In 2020, the world was thrown into chaos due to a sudden outbreak of an epidemic. Many have lost their lives, and we have distanced ourselves from each other. The situation was worse in developing countries with weak public health care systems. So we made a decision to deliver hopes of miracles to the other side of the world. In October 2020, for the DR Congo that was facing multiple crises due to COVID-19, the Republic of Korea shared its experience of coping with COVID-19 and built a second COVID-19 diagnostic center in DR Congo together with the UNDP. This diagnostic center was built to expand the COVID-19 testing capabilities with a new system and new equipment. Je lui ai parlé de la nécessité de mettre un laboratoire de diagnostic et de recherche à l'université pour appuyer les activités de la surveillance de la COVID-19. With the support from Korea and the UNDP, DR Congo is now able to conduct more than 200 tests a day. In 2021, Korea provided an additional $500,000 in quarantine supplies to the center. Such foreign aid, made by the government or public institutions of one country to a developing country, is called Official Development Assistance, in short, ODA. At the end of June 2020, to help developing countries respond to COVID-19 and to support sustainable development, Korea launched the ODA Korea Building Trust Initiative. Within a year of the launch of the initiative, approximately 120 countries were supported with about 180 million US dollars. We'll continue to work together in the DAC to promote development, to tackle the pandemic, and to build back better and greener for everyone in the world. In Uzbekistan, Korean professor Jae Wook Choi was awarded the first class health medal in accordance with the Uzbekistan presidential decree. Uzbekistan evaluated that Professor Chue made a meaningful contribution as a COVID-19 national advisor. The reason why Korea is so well aware of the importance of development cooperation is because it was lent a helping hand 60 years ago. Right after the war, Korea was able to create an opportunity for economic growth through the support of the international community. With Korea's ongoing efforts to improve its ODA system and scale up its ODA volume, Korea was able to join the OECD Development Assistance Committee in 2010. Korea brings to the DAC its own experience of transitioning from an aid recipient to an aid donor, a leading example and a source of inspiration for developing countries of how sound economic policies can drive growth and development is a testament that mutual trust. Korea is a country that has evolved 
from one of the world's poorest country to an OECD DAC donor country. Now, Korea is giving back what it received years ago to countries that are going through similar difficulties. To support the developing country's response to COVID-19, for their sustainable development, and for a safe world for all, Korea will work together to create another miracle, just like the miracle of the Han River it has achieved with the help of the international community.